Okay. That was good. Maybe it'll work. Maybe it won't. <clears throat> Maybe they'll do that again before the end of the stream. While I'm in mid mid sentence. Again. Alright. Well, <clears throat> hopefully their updates are done. But again, we've had an interruption with an update from the uh, ISP and it's still flashing yellow which means they're probably not done it's going to go out again I'm sure but we'll just deal with it you know <sighs> I didn't know it was out until like 60 seconds in and I was like oh shit there we go again alright what was I doing oh yeah I was sailing this badass boat across here That little boat right there is going to be in my way. The merchant boat. That's right. You wave off, buddy. <sighs> Coming in fast. Coming in hard. That was a good park job, I think. Put a shirt on. We're gonna have a problem if you step any closer. Oh, uh, that's right. You'll die. And I'll have a bounty on me. For killing you. She's on the other side of this wall. Here we go. I found your key. Your associate certainly kept it well protected. He ought to have. I paid him well enough to do so. Where exactly are you getting your drachmi from? I have very few needs and spend only on what I find important. I'm very nearly three. Very nearly. Now that I have the key, is there anything else I need to prepare to visit the Island of Fire? You tell me, Mistios. Do you feel prepared to explore the foundry of Ephestos? Wait, you're not going to ask me a strange question first? Perhaps I'll think of one later. Hmm. I'm ready to explore that island. Very good. You are proving your worth. Am I now? I'm impressed. There is an island swathed with clouds of smoke where the earth blazes with fire. It's called the Foundry of yes. Ephestos. A legendary helmet is kept there. Bring it here so I might study it. Seems like a dangerous journey for just a helmet. It's not nearly the only treasure there. You can keep anything Already else been you there. find. All right. I'll go to the island and find the helmet. Yeah, I've already found the helmet, I think. See, I've already been there. Wow. Lurky lurk indeed. Yeah, I made it back over here, alright. I made it back. See, I've been to the I damn it, this island is right Oh my god. I just I was just at this island. Now we're gonna go to this island. Oh, I've been to this island before. There's not a fast travel spot. Yeah, there is right here. But there's nowhere for the boat to park. Yeah, there is. Okay. <sighs> Digging that outfit. Yeah. That's the uh, northern traveler outfit. Oh. I dig it. I like it. Where is the boat dock? What the hell, where's the boat dock? It's over there. Okay. Yeah. Oh, 
Got wood. More wood. Yeah, this is this is my my past for the restricted area on my back here. Try me. Yeah. Got a lot of statues you tinking around on here. Oh, oh, sorry, lady. Oops. You shouldn't stand in the way. I was running. I was running. Yeah, wouldn't mind another AC movie, maybe uh, Alexios this time. It would be kind of cool, but it would be just like the Odyssey. There we go. Where's the front of the boat? Yeah, where the eagle, where the eagle lies. Let's go, boys. Of that. Commanders left the helm. Volcanic Island from Hell. Here we go. I'll look to some stuff here. Take that. Some sulfur there. Oh, jeez. Gotta go on this side. I hear you, Icarus. ISP doing maintenance. Yep. Uh, I'm back on now. Nim. Nim's probably not seeing it. Wakey, wakey, Nim. <clears throat> yeah, so it's entirely possible that uh, we'll get cut out again because the the ISP is doing maintenance tonight. They've done they've they've cut me off twice. Why am I doing that? doing that Woo -hoo. Woo -hoo. <laughs> oh that was scary No! Damn it. I'm jumping off over there. Oop. Damn it! Get out of the fucking. Damn it, damn it, damn it.
stuff here. Something might be up here. It's not gonna be over here. It's gonna be down there where those guys are. Pretty sure. It's another entrance. Festus is here. Welcome, welcome. <laughs> All right. Yeah, I had to, I had to answer a question there. All right. So these guys have got to die one at a time, probably. Oh, that one right there. how they ended up you know I was gonna be sneaky about it but they did the thing you know so I just had to take them out like that they weren't very cooperative about it already got that is this thing this helmet I don't I don't see it it's not here maybe I already picked it up entrance to the tomb find the entrance to the tomb Oh, 
Oh, I've been here before. I've been here before. I wasn't able to open the door. <clears throat> I've been to this place before, but I wasn't able to open the door here. Okay, we're in the tomb. Rofoni was an extraordinary woman born of Andromeda, daughter of the proud queen and king of Ethiopia, and hmm. Perseus, the Gorgon Slayer after whom she is named. Interesting. See, I didn't get this last time. <laughs> it's not very bright with those lights, is it? Still not very bright, is it? Go this way first. So this goes back up. There it is. Oh, there's a light there. So I've been here. I took the right instead of the left. It has long been tradition that women should marry but once, mm. as virgins. If their husbands died before them, they were to live out their lives as widows. Gorofoni defied this tradition to become the greatest grandmother of Elas. Oh. Tradition. Not law. Already been here. All right, down we go. A little bit further on. It is said that a warrior woman of advanced age brought so much chaos to the people of Lake Tritonis that Perseus himself arrived to take her life. And some wise people say that was Gorgophoni enjoying her last act of rebellion. Hmm. Interesting. Oh shit, he's then struck me. Bitch. Fucking flaming snakes.
hate snakes. I knew there was going to be one, though. that oh move stuff over again Hate snakes. Gorgophony's first husband was Piriades, king of Messene and Sparta. Their sons grew up to be bold princes and kings of Sparta themselves. Interesting. You get a little history lesson here. I'm, I'm, you know, this is a mythology history kind of thing, but that's kind of cool. A little history lesson. A little mythology, a little history, a little mythology, a little history. If you mix the two together, you might have a good story. Uh, no, that's right. <laughs> Nim took a shower. He probably smells like Nim again. <clears throat> One second. What is this? Um, I guess. I guess Nim uh, didn't come back. He's probably, eh, he maybe lurking. Or he's asleep by now. I don't know. Nim's probably asleep. Probably leave him alone. Shouldn't pick on Nim when he's sleeping, right? No, that's the best time. That's the best time. Uh, hold on a second, guys. Let me just uh, square this away here. Um, little slight technical difficulty. At least we're still on the air. Live and on the air. Coming to you from Savage Land. With snakes. What? No. We don't like snakes. We don't want any snakes. <clears throat> if I ever create a video game, it's going to be without snakes.
look at this. How to avoid those things. Oh, look here. There we go. There we go. Like it's going to offer us a bunch of light, right? Not much light at all. They'll put that away. Oh, no, no, that's a pretty good bit of light for that. Not bad. Not bad at all. Him that time. But Gorgophony had a second husband, King Oivalos of Sparta, who would bring her even greater children and grandchildren. Helen of Troy, Castor and Polydevkis, Clitemistra, and many more were her descendants. I see. This is a history lesson. Can't get through that door. It's up here. Oh, I see. There's the side door over here. We should probably take that first. What did I do that for? I don't know what I did that for. Ow, oh, damn it. further down. Hmm. There's another way in. Not in here. It's going to be up here somewhere. Oh, 
not one of those over here, is there? No. Nope. Just over here. Ow. Damn it, there's a big eagle. Here. That's what I'm looking for. This helmet seems common, <clears throat> but it's been carefully hidden. I should get it back to that woman. Okay. She did keep, say keep all the other loot, right? So, you know, we're just going to keep looking for loot, right? That's the thing to do when you're in a dungeon with snakes. It's a nice eagle. Eagle bear. Hmm. Oh, I've been here. Is there something I missed? There was something I missed, I think. Shit! Ow! Fuck. Oh, I missed uh, lighting the torch there. And then, uh... No, I think that was it. See, that's weird because there's stuff down here somewhere. that how do you get there get there not a way in there no nope. no way down there it seems closed off for some reason is there a way in there Missed something somewhere. Oh, oh, I see. It's all those. I didn't miss something. No, nope, I didn't. get out of the uh, danger zone here apparently went in a circle I like when I go in a circle go 
go this way. This will, this will get me back out, I think. There we go. Got through that. Where's she at? She's gonna be way over here. Would not an easy way to get there. Not a boat dock? Oh, shit. Uh, that's the closest one, too, isn't it? It would be so much easier if I just go to one that's got a boat dock, wouldn't it? It's not one there either. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. There's no easy way. That's great. I see it, but you have to pay your dues. Yeah. Yeah, I guess you do. What's what's your name again? Never heard of you. Speed up. The outside of the city. Come on. There we go. When I get any closer, I go this way. Shortcut. I know I'm getting closer now because there's the uh, the big butt there. supposed to happen just left my horse back there poor horse I just left him back there that there you go island and trap tomb. I've been were. back for 20 minutes now, Nim. Even you, you exaggerate, Eagle Bearer. But did you find the helmet? Of course I did. Actually, close to 30 but minutes, Nim. a terrible place. And who are you to send me there? Who do you think I am, Alexios? Some say I show great wisdom. Others say I am wisdom herself. Tell me, who do you think I am? You sent me to a graveyard where I met a desperate man who said Athena herself had sent me to kill him. But I suppose that could mean he only thought you were Athena. It's unwise to give too much credit to the rantings of a madman. 
Then you sent me to a pirate in need, who asked me to help him as he saw fit. Was that a divine test of wisdom? Or just practicality? You sent yourself to a pirate. I merely provided the chance. Finally, that strange hermit with the key. He was even under a statue of Athena's icon, the owl. Did you set that all up as a joke, or is there truth in his beliefs? So many thoughts in that head of yours. It's nearly too much to contemplate. Make your decision, Alexios. You want me to believe you're Athena? It seems you want me to believe you're Athena. Mysterious riddles, a helmet of all things to find. It's clever, but obvious. If this is the case, it is I who should congratulate you on your cleverness. Here, show me the helmet. I hope this was worth it. You aren't very principled, are you? One who stands for nothing falls for everything. I've seen all I need to. Here you go. Thank you. I hope you've gained some wisdom from this journey. Yes, I've learned that profit can come from the strangest sources. I have no idea. What the hell it You have earned my respect, Alexios. I'm really confused. And your point is, well, I mean, you know. I'm confused about whatever that uh, that mission that uh, quest line was. That was just weird. That was a weird quest line. see what it says here Shut up, you. I'm not going over there. Me and the missus are leaving in just an hour, over an hour. Oh, okay. Where are you going? You going somewhere cool? Or are you just, uh, going? Shopping? Mini vacay? Visiting others? My dear Alexios, over here. Do you have a moment? I was hoping to have the chance to thank you for all you've done. What did you have in mind? Poet may be my day job, but there's more to me than that. I am also a very talented cook. Allow me to make you a fabulous meal. Uh, doctors? Oh, I got you. 180 miles for now. Holy cow, man. 180 miles for... That's weird. What did it say? Oh, specialist, I got you. I'm probably gonna this is I'm gonna regret this. I'd like that. Great. There's just one thing. I'll need a little help hunting down some ingredients. Literally. You're treating me, you said. After all we've been through together. Surely you can agree that I'm a lover, not a fighter. Um. For how many bandits I've killed for you, it's pretty safe to say you're not a fighter. I have to compensate somehow. What do you need me to hunt? This dish calls for venison. Any of the beasts wandering nearby should do. Meet me at the cliffs near the Ipernistra camp once you find some. I regret this. Not having any kind of relationship with this guy. This is ridiculous. What the hell did the thing say anyway? It said, uh, This doesn't sound right. Hmm. 
Yep, don't like it at all. Uh, your deer in Corinthia? Forest on Poseidon. Get over there. It's a graveyard. What was that? That's weird. That was weird. That's a start, but Likinos will need more. Plenty of meat for Likinos' dinner. Okay. That's a long way to go. Why is it so long way? I have such a long way to go. Okay, worry and stored valuables. Yet he was never to see them again. Lexios found the letter instead. Well, it's on the way. Two birds, one stone. Shit.
Gotta be in the cave, right? Where's the cave? Where's this cave? see a damn cave anywhere but there has to be one somewhere the hell is this cave this is a cave over here somewhere this cave all right where the fuck is the cave right there cave is there, then whatever that is is in the cave. Ah, oh, there we go. Drag me. All right, we got that out of the way. No, no more cave to worry about. This guy better not be getting romantic. I might have to kick his ass. I, I, I don't do that. We don't swing that way. I don't mind having dinner with you, but you better not, you know, try anything funky. Beautiful view. It certainly is. Did you manage to hunt down our food? Here's the meat. Perfect. I'll get started. Please, make yourself comfortable. Yep, well... That was delicious. I told you I could cook. Was the food worth it? A few deer are no match for a mighty mistress. I wish I had your skill. And confidence. Fighter or not, I'm sure it takes a lot to be a renowned poet in Athens. I... Uh, may have exaggerated my accomplishments as a poet a bit earlier. The truth is... I'm not just home for a visit. I ran out of drachmi in oh. Athens. Why lie to your brother about this? Or to me? Timotheus has always been my father's son. In every way. They both fought for Athens. They both worked in the family business. Timotheus' path was never for me. So I left for Athens to strike out on my own. You're afraid of what he'll think. He'll say it was irresponsible of me to leave in the first place. And he's right. I don't have any Rachmi. Or means to earn it. Here you go. That's a good idea. You're an amazing cook, Likinos. If you're looking for a way to make a living, you should start there. <laughs> I guess everyone needs to eat. Besides, any skill that impresses you is worth pursuing. You never answered my question, though. Why lie to me about your career? Isn't it obvious? I didn't want to appear a failure to you. From the moment I met you, I knew you were amazing. Hmm. 
I'm just someone who's had to fight every day of my life. Still, you saved my life, Alexios. I'll never forget that. Well, I'm glad I did. This has been nice, Likinos. It really has. You're gonna leave it with that, huh? Okay, that's good. Good, he didn't try nothing. So now he's gonna be a cook. Kino's the cook. Chef. He can be a chef, yeah. Famous Greek chef, Lakinos. I do have time for the other part of this, don't I? Get this right here first. Stuff to pick up. That looks dangerous. Too dangerous. Too dangerous. I'm just up here picking up rocks and stones. There we go. Got one of those. Oh, look, there's somebody else up here. They died here. That's a shame. A nice view, really commanding view from here. There's a Festus over there. Yeah, now where is this place I gotta go? I see I already finished those off once before. There's something here. And this is where uh, Timios is. Over on this island, so I'll have to go back down here. Huh. <clears throat> See, now that brings up an interesting question. Should I just go get the boat? I should go get the boat. Yeah, let's go get the boat. And there's something, like I said, there's something down here, too. We're gonna go get the boat. Damn, that's a long way to go. It's a long run. Calling the boat. That always happened to me. I got, uh, hold on a second, I gotta fix that. Admittedly, I'm getting tired already. I'm gonna finish this off uh, best I can. I got about uh, 25, 30 minutes left. 25 minutes? 30 minutes? Somewhere in there left. Sure, we can finish off something in 30 minutes. Uh-oh. Gonna sneeze. 
Uh, uh, that was kind of painful. Let's go, boys. See why not? We're already here. Now's not the time for song. No, no singing. We'll come back for you later, team else. He's stuck in there again. Same boat. All right, where's this? Uh, it's right here. It's an Athenian ship out there. Commander. I bet you will. There's a shark. I knew there's at least one shark here somewhere. Where's the other one? There's there's never just one. Is there only just one shark? That's really weird, just one shark being there. Oh, no, there's two. It was underneath the boat. Merchant ship there going by. the sharks there's one where's the other Where's the other one? I know there's at least... Oh, there it is. I see the other one. Oh, look at that. go we got that <clears throat> that's out of the way and something for the ship there let me take a look at what that was uh 
What does that look like? Oh, that doesn't look nearly as cool as what I had. It's just a, it's just a plane. What's that one look like? That looks kind of cool too, though. I'm gonna stick with my uh. I'm gonna stick with Zeus. It's the coolest. It's the coolest, aside from the Babylonian. The Babylonian is really cool. Babylonian looks like uh, oh wait no damn it. Pushing buttons. Stop pushing buttons. Babylonian looks like this. All green. And then this is the Phoenician. Looks kind of cool too. That's kind of a cool ship. Ship build too. We're gonna stick with that though. I like that one so. There we go. Rotate around. can map uh, right there there we go commander leaving the helm Just a little swim, a little dip in the pond. Just why not, right? Little dooby doo doo da. Right there in the pond. Alexios, there you are. Am I interrupting? This is where I used to practice sparring with my father. After he retired to the fishing business, he lost interest. But I kept up the practice on my own. Okay, I guess if I was playing the female character, I'd probably, you know, already have bedded all the men in the game. <laughs> sparring without a partner isn't a real challenge. Are you trying to goad me into a sparring match, mercenary? I might be interested in some friendly competition. I don't think that's a good idea. Are you scared, Athenian? I just... Fine. Let's spar. Okay, you got a problem with it? Let's see what you've got. Oh. Damn, he's punching. That's all you got. Oh. Ha, I'm just getting started. Just the Spartans. Oh, there, sir. You okay? You fought well, Athenian. Timoseos. Timoseos, what are you doing? I... no, stop, stop, no, no, stay back, get away from me. I'll stay back, I promise. I don't know what I'll do if you get too close. You're not going to hurt me, Timotheos. You don't... you don't know that. I don't know if I could stop myself right now. I know you're stronger than whatever this is. When I get like this, if I lose control for even a second, the terrible things I see myself doing. Timotheos. No, no, no. Stop, stop. Just breathe. I'm okay. I'm okay. Thank you. You're safe, Timotheos. I promise. I feel better. Thank you. Would you mind staying with me for a moment? Whatever you need. 
Wow. Freaky dude. Father handled coming back from the war so much better than I did. Any loud noise or unexpected hand on my shoulder and my heart burst from my chest. But he never flinched. Did you tell him? I couldn't bear to tell father the reason I was discharged, let alone this. I wanted to make him proud. Why were you discharged? I... lost control in a battle and killed one of my comrades. My commander and I were close, so he discharged me with mania instead of charging me with treason. When I returned from the war, father never asked why. I don't know if he suspected or... Maybe he was hiding his struggles, the way you hid yours. Finding out father lied about his armor, not to mention his debts, has left me wondering if there aren't other things he kept hidden. But even so, he was strong enough to hide it from me while he lived. I can't even hide it from you now. War isn't easy, Timotheos. Everyone comes back with wounds that never heal. Physical scars fade. I'm not sure the ones I have ever will. Hmm. PTSD and... Uh... It's going to be all right, Timotheos. For the first time, I think it might be. It will be. Just, you know, be okay with it. The sun sets, the sun rises. I should check in on Timotheos and Likinos at their father's house. <laughs> there we go. A little PTSD action going on with him. stuck nope there we go <laughs> almost smashed by the boat we got smashed by the boat gotta run around the, a lot of running around in this game and docks that aren't quite finished put some clothes on walking around in his underwear this didn't take anything oh shit I'll talk to him after I look at the other stuff this looks like one of the bandits that killed Diocles uh, okay <clears throat> Likinos are you alright they took him the bandits who killed my father took Timotheus where did they go? To the ruins of Mikine. Mikine. Please, you have to help him. Okay. Mikinos, huh? Got a red hand on the ball there. Oh, jeez. How far away is that? Ugh. The lack of fast travel spots here is, is insane. Get up there. Hey, look at there. Oh, nice. 
It was just laying there. Awesome. Must have passed that spot about 10 times tonight and missed it. All these little side quests and, and, uh, and oddball little questy areas are, are just, you know, they're, they're, they're not a, a, a through storyline, but they're all really good. That's a long way to go. Oh my God. It's that place. I got about 10 minutes to do this. Mm. over there more junk way over there more junk way over there coming around this side here. Oh shit.
You're clearly outmatched. Outmatch that. buried excellent got my arrow back there we go we're clear now come on team yes Demosios, we have to get out of here Demosios. die spartan dogs to the ferryman with you one up there Spartan dogs, where are they hiding? You're safe, Timotheos. I promise. Alexios? Yes, it's me. You're all right now. Timotheos, you're safe. You saved us once again, mercenary. In more ways than one. The famed Eagle Bearer hasn't saved you just yet. Okay. It's nice to finally meet the Oclis's boys. And you must be the man responsible for my father's death. Responsible? Your father was one of my best smugglers before he screwed me over. Our father would never work for you. He had no choice. Dear the Oclis liked to gamble. With my support, he could place bad bets all day long and keep that lovely home of oh, yours. Something tells me your support came with strings attached. Hardly. The Oclis and I oh, were boy, here we go. years before I killed him. Unfortunately, a man who gambles with another man's drachmi stops being a gambler and turns into a thief. You got your payment in the Oclis's blood. What do you want with Likinos and Timotheos? The Oclis may be dead. But I haven't received my drachmi yet. You expect me to pay? One way or another, yes. <sighs> Enough! Let's finish this already! So be it. There we go. Thank you for saving me, Alexios. There's something I've been meaning to tell you. I need to tell Alexios something too. When I'm with you, the darkness inside me fades away. I didn't think I'd feel happiness like this. Yeah. I'm the only reason you even know each other. The fates have spoken. The gods brought us together. I feel it but, in the fiber of yeah, my soul. Yeah, you know... I just like you as friends. Both of you. <laughs> I... Yeah. See, if that's how you really It is. Feel, Thank you. Well, 
Thank you again for saving me and for everything. Goodbye, I guess. <laughs> <sighs> no, I'm just, you know, not, not swinging that way. That's it. Where did, uh, where did I throw this body over here? I mean, he went flying. I have no idea where he went. He went way the hell over here somewhere. I threw him like a long way. He's, he's totally, the body's totally gone. I threw the body like way up in the air. Oh, wait, is that him? I think that's him. That's him. Yep, that's him. There we go. Yeah, it's, uh... Oh, damn it. No, oh, damn it. There we go. Perfect. What we needed right there. <laughs> there we go. Took all the stuff. All is at it. Well, them boys got their sort, you know, sorted out there. So maybe that'll work. Indeed. Um, there's still a couple of places I haven't found here. This is undiscovered as well. Yeah, these little quests are kind of cool. The uh, little green ones there. Come on, horsey. We're going to ride a little bit. Come here. Dang it. Where are you going? Fart dog. Yet another military camp, indeed. Hera's watch. Um, what about that one? What is that? It's way over on the other side of this hill. What was that? Picking up stuff as we go. guys Pathfinder okay one of those folks well we figured that one out next there's another one on the list there's another one right here all these little places here it's a little foggy in here Shit.
Pig farm? It's a pig farm. <laughs> All right. Well, I'm way the hell over here now. It's a weird place to be. There's another place I hadn't been right there. If I got time for it, I got time for this one more. As long as it's nothing major. Riding around in the dark. Oh, there's Medusa. There's Medusa right there. That's Medusa. Don't run don't run into her in the dark alley, right? Look out, animals. Depleted silver mine. Now that's a place we could go to at some point. Except for us in the middle of nowhere. We end up in Argos for that. Yeah, we can do that. Let's go to Argos. We can do that next time on the uh <coughs> the depleted silver mine, right? <clears throat> Indeed. It's a long travel time for a short distance. Taking forever. There it is. What the heck is all this? I gotta get this off here. Hold on one second. Ow, my knuckles hurt. We are officially at 31 degrees here in Savage Land. 31 degrees Fahrenheit. I don't know what that is in Celsius. Uh, but it's cold. It's officially freezing. We have a freeze warning for tonight in Savage Land on the uh, East Coast here in Virginia. And, uh, yeah, it's first one of the season. Winter, folks. We're going to skip fall and go straight in. That's right. Uh, looks like our forecast for the rest of the week is uh, cold, cold, and cold. Not getting anything over uh, 30, 34 degrees uh, on Monday night uh, coming up, and then 40 degrees Tuesday night. So Tuesday will be the, the, the warm day. Uh, rest of our week here in Savage Land is mid-40s all the way to Sunday when it'll peak at 52. Yeah. At around two or three Celsius, yeah, it's, it's freezing here. We've got uh, we got frozen freezing temperatures. I brought all the, brought all the house plants in, so it's uh it's nice and chilly. It's nice and chilly. Looks like uh, Monday next week comes up to sixty degrees, and uh, Tuesday's gonna be sixty two. So we'll get uh, we'll get back into the sixties for uh, next week. But this week's gonna be bone chilling. For the first week of November. Good thing is, is uh, there's no, there's no, um, there's no rain in the forecast, so and, and no or no wintry mix either. Uh, we have a twenty percent chance on Sunday uh, of getting a little bit of precipitation, but that's that's midday. Uh, it's like fifties for midday. But yeah, winter has arrived. We just skipped fall. We got about two weeks of fall and then run straight into winter. It's awesome. Yeah, got to break out the leather jacket tonight, baby. Yeah, I do like my jackets. That's the thing. Everybody always complains, oh, it's cold outside. You know what? I, I dig it when it starts getting cold because I can wear my jackets. 
I do like my jackets. It's like the ultimate accessory. Wear a whole different outfit and have, you know, nice, nice, uh, stylish leather jacket on. I do like my leather. Uh, I got a nice suede jacket too I wear. But, uh, yeah. they both look good with a tie, by the way, I'll point out. I have to... You know, that's the great thing about <laughs> about ties. People are like, oh, wear a tie. Who's wearing a tie? Well, let me just tell you about ties. They'll keep your neck warm. Yeah, they will. You don't get quite as cold that way. <clears throat> Indeed. Well, folks, that's going to be it for us tonight. I do appreciate everybody hanging out with us and appreciate your uh, patience with the uh, ISP reboots that happened uh, twice tonight for the updates. Uh, hopefully it'll, it'll you know, I, I don't know how they can improve service, but <laughs> hopefully whatever they were trying to do is improved and not, not made it worse. But uh, the service has been awesome from, uh, from Glow Fiber. That's right, Glow Fiber, folks. They're... Um, they're, they, it's just been awesome service with them for the, so far. The uh, the speeds I've gotten with this have been incredible. Um, it's it's right up there, close to the uh, the gigabit. Um, I think my speeds were were like nine ninety on download and uh, uh, about uh, eight. 890 on the upload uh the last time i checked with a with a ping of two <laughs> i'll take it i will take it so uh yeah not bad at all anyway folks <clears throat> do tune in again uh is it woden's day night woden's day night for some more jazzy shenanigans and shintuckery right here on savages tv it'll be awesome as always, it'll be jazzy. It'll be shenanigans and shintuckery. We like to do that. You know, shenanigans and shintuckery. And, uh, Nim, are you, uh, are you back to streaming, buddy? I look like you were on this morning. Or yesterday morning. Now. <laughs> I think, I think Nim was back. If you see Nim streaming, folks... You guys tune in. Trust me on that. Make sure you give Nim a follow. Not not yet fully. Yeah. It doesn't matter, man. You, you, five, five minutes with Nim will change your life. <laughs> it's true. It's true. And you're away today, so not today. Okay. So he won't be on today. He's, um, he's got an appointment to take care of. Well, I don't know what the appointment's for. I know it's a specialist or whatever, but uh, you know, whatever it's for, you don't have to tell me because, you know, medical privacy and all that shit is true, you know. Um, but uh, good luck. Yeah, hope everything turns out all right. Indeed. So, yeah, folks. Uh, do give him a follow so so next time he's streaming, you uh, you catch him. Indeed. Uh, let me see. Where's the rest of that? I'll put the rest of it put the rest of it out there make sure to give a follow my fellow teammates of the 111th savage legion that's right folks the home for misfit toys and gamers give a follow to all of the legion with some exciting games retro to new betas and demos the 111th a quirky entertaining group of streamers that has a little something for everyone so give them a follow folks each and every one you'll be glad you did you'll be the bee's knees you will you will it's true I've seen people that have turned to bees knees. Oh, wrong button. Turn back around there, Alexios. There we go. Woo. <laughs> and don't forget to check out our Discord. It's a jazzy community to chit chat in. So uh just uh pop on in there and say hi. Indeed. There's your invite, folks. <clears throat> Our, uh, if I can spell, our social link, I'm tired too, our social links over at the Twitterverse, we do tweet when we go live, so it's another form of notification that you can pick up right there. 
Oh, that's a little crescent moon on the horizon there, huh? Check out our YouTube channel as well. There's uh, nearly 2,000 videos on the uh, YouTube channel, most of which are full-length streams, just like this one for your perusal. So uh, make sure you uh, check those out and drop a subscribe while you're there. Indeed. Legion swag, we got it over at the Teespring's merch shop. You can check that out in the panels down below this video. There's a couple links there. It will take you to the Teespring site where you can find some awesome merchandise like the Feeling Jazzy Punk collection, the 111th Savage Legion Shield collection, the SAVG Emblem collection, and of course the Jazzy McDangerous collection. Feeling Jazzy Punk, get yours over at Teespring's today. <coughs> Excuse me. Well, yeah, folks, that's going to be it for us tonight. Do tune in again, Warden's Day night after 11.30 p.m. U.S. Eastern for some more jazzy shenanigans and shintuckery right here on Savages TV. It'll be fun. I, I don't even know what we're playing tomorrow, so it might be this. It might be something else. I haven't decided. I'm, I'm in one of those funky funk moods, so I'm, I'm liable just to pull something out of the hat. I don't know. It's going to be a great day in Savage Land. I just know it. For now, folks. From all of us here at Savages TV and the 111th Savage Legion, I bid you all a good morning, a fan tastic afternoon, a groovy evening, no matter where you are in the world. I'm Doc Savage, reminding you not to let the red roaches bite. If they do bite them back, at least twice. Stay jazzy, folks. And until next time. Laters. Daters. Indeed. Sliding around with your hands up in the air. Look at that. You're on a skating rink going. Everybody do the zombie dancing like Nim. I
Crunchy Pussy to the Everybody follow Crunchy Pussy to the head. I think we're low. Oh, sweet. There'll be, be a fade kit there. Pistol whip. Get up there. Can't jump that, really? Can't jump that. You gotta explore and then go, oh, this is a great place. I'll go over here. Hey, there's your. What the fuck? <laughs> In a world where one man has only one mission. Some mission does a coffee. But the mug is ceramic. It's always been ceramic. Coming soon to a theater near you, if there is coffee there. Spread it everywhere. <laughs> it's like a disease. It's like a super jazzy disease. Just throw it all over the place. <sighs> so back by popular demand, a new improved Sombajin Dosa coffee. Three times a door with only half the coffee. What? Try to experience the joys of extra dough. Wait, half the coffee? I out of here. Uh, really? Do this? Half the coffee. Get butt stroked in a minute. Boomer will live. See this? This is my boomstick. kill you, you'll be awake. You'll be facing me, and you'll be armed. I'm unarmed? Good. Doctor, you, you're being childish. Well, of course I am. There's no point in being grown up if you can't be childish sometimes. If someone ever tries to kill you, you try to kill him right back. was fun! <laughs> <laughs>